Good morning. Uh, would you please introduce yourself? Good morning. My name is Theo Willems. I'm from the Netherlands. I'm 59 of age. I have a family and I'm a, a professionally I'm an engineer. Good. Uh, Theo, would you please explain what was your uh, problem before you started Ayurvedic treatment? Almost uh, one year and a half ago, I noticed that uh, my left eye became tired quite soon. Mm -hmm. There was tension in the eye and I couldn't read uh, very well anymore. So when I had my spectacles tested, they said, well, you need to go to the hospital because there is something wrong with your left eye. I went to the hospital, they took uh, pictures of my eyes with uh, flashlights and they were pictures of the, the, uh, the screen at the back of the eyes. Retina, yeah. And uh, they told me that uh, the left eye had lost about 60% uh, of its uh, capacity to uh, have a sharp view. Uh, my partner, Mieke, uh, studies Ayurvedic uh, studies and uh, she said, well, there are possibilities in the Ayurvedic uh, fields to, to cure it, perhaps. Because here in the Western world, there is no cure for this problem. They can only investigate it and they are looking for medicine, but they can only say that you should eat uh, very well in, in uh, with vegetables and fruits and things like that. So we made an appointment with you in uh, Holland when you were here in April uh, last year and you investigated me and uh, well you told me that regeneration of the macula uh, was possible in Ayurvedic uh, ways. So we made an appointment to go to Kerala uh, in September of last year and I had a cure of uh, four weeks cleaning, cleansing and uh, eye treatments. When we got back in Holland in the midst of uh, October uh, I was quite tired. Uh, I had lost weight because of the cleansing and uh, I couldn't read too much. Uh, the characters in the books were a bit uh, diffuse, uh, so I couldn't read and I decided to stop my computer work as an engineer. It was your advice to stop uh, computer work and in the time that followed uh, more rest came to my eyes. The tension got out and after three months being at home uh, and having uh, taken the medicine you prescribed, uh, the eyes were getting better and I was feeling stronger again. Um, in December we had pictures taken at the hospital uh, and these pictures were quite bad. Uh, this means that the, the good eye, the right eye, had uh, less capacity. Uh, it went down to 80% and the left eye went down to uh, 30%. So we decided to come back in uh, April for new pictures and uh, then there was a surprise because the left eye went back to almost 100% and the left eye went back to 50%. So the professor in the universal University uh, Clinic uh, congratulated me with uh, these results and uh, um, uh, that was uh, the end of uh, the examinations uh, over there. So now it's in the midst of uh, April that we uh, have new contact here in Holland and uh, we will come back to you in uh, January next year to have some cleansing but more nourishing of the eye and the whole uh, body to uh, make a further balance in my body and uh, it will surely uh, give better results uh, by that time. Good. And what is the subjective change that you feel in the vision now? Um, already when the pictures were uh, taken in December, 
showed that the degeneration had gone further, so my eyes were getting worse, uh, I had the feeling that I, my sight was getting better. So I mailed you and uh, I told you uh, that there was a contradiction between the measurements and my feelings and my experience. Um, and you told me, well, let the function go before the structure. And that's how it happened uh, indeed. At first I thought that my brains had compensated for the loss in my eyes. But uh, perhaps that is uh, so far apart. But uh, now in, uh, in uh, April the new pictures have uh, showed that uh, the macula has, uh, is now in a better condition again. Thank you. Thank you for your good care.